My last here from Ascot before I hand you over to Martin is a Queen Elizabeth the second stakes, a one mile group one, three year olds and up. So number one, Achilles for Hans Joan along with a Mute, number two, three, Glory Lane for Jim Murray, four, Camp for Van for Darren Thompson, five, Big Tom Brady for Paul Rhodes, six, Hot Pursuit for Django, seven, Outside Air for Darren Thompson, eight, Robbers Lance for Jim Murray, nine is Rocket Man for Joshua Sutherland, Vinnie Gerrard's Ankin Abbasier is ten, Champagne Problems for Hilltop is eleven, Firefly for Paul is twelve, Illusio for Molly at Surfer is thirteen, and Mind of Arnold Django makes up fourteen. They're already in the gates. Flag's been dropped and they're away. So it's a mile for the girls here, these fillies and mares. And it's Amute for Hans Joan that bursts out the pack inside the first furlong. And he leads by four. And the chasing pack that have uh, got a couple of groups here. We've got the ones that are running in sort of centre course, the ones that are over towards the fence. So nearest to us, we've got uh, outside area, the yellow silks of Hot Suit, My Nirvana. The grey, I think, is Champagne Problems. Inside of that is Glory Lane. We've got Robbers Lane over towards the fence. Well, that actually could be Glory Lane over there in the fence. The other one there is Ankin Abatia on his own. Two Paul Rhodes horses, Big Tom Brady and Firefly. And we've got Josh's Rocket there. Just on the outside of that is Camp Van. And the one right tailed off a little bit at the moment is Elusivo. So with just half a mile left to travel, halfway through the race, is still a Mute that leads. But they're starting to cut into his lead now. And the one that's going to challenge first is Hot Pursuit. Hot Pursuit comes over to join him. The one pushing through again is Ankin Abatia. So it's Ankin Abatia that just noses up now from Rocketman against the fence. But they're all holding here and it's two and a half furlongs left to run. It's Hot Pursuit pushes through again out wide is the grey Champagne Problems. It's going to try and win it from centre of the course. So it's Champagne Problems leads them inside the two now. Champagne Problems from Hot Pursuit. Rocketman against the fence. My Nirvana, Achilles, Amute, Ankin Abatia is still there. But it's Champagne Problems that's got a length advantage as it come down to the furlong. It's Champagne Problems running on now well. It's Big Tom Brady to try and catch him. So it's Champagne Problems, Big Tom Trady, outside area. Outside area on the outside, but it's Champagne Problems from the outside area, moving well in as elusive oak. But it's Champagne Problems, another win for John Morgan. That's three out of the first four. Champagne Promise takes it from Big Tom Brady, outside area was third. Elusivo run on really well from being a little bit tailed off halfway through that race. The fourth, I think. So a win for John Morgan takes the Queen Elizabeth II stakes with champagne problems. Big Tom Brady was second for Paul Rhodes. Third was outside area for Darren Thompson. Fourth was Elusivo for Molly at Surfer. And fifth was Robbers Lance for Jim Murray. And I hand you over to Martin and I'll catch you up over on the hunt.